Hello everyone and welcome back to my heavenly babies. Joining me is Mariska. She wants to go over this big haul that we got because we got some things for her and uh, for my nursery and I just can't wait to share it with you guys. We went to some grad sales yesterday, hit a couple Goodwills and boy I found some great stuff. Really good finds, really good prices. Just unbelievable and I'll go over it as quick as I can so the video is not too long and then after I get my other two babies from AliExpress I'm going to do a nursery tour because I've changed a few things I've you know switched out the car seats to bouncies I got found on Facebook market at grad sales things like that and I just want to show you guys kind of how I have it set up now even though I got a lot more babies it still is you know set up pretty cute so and it's not like too overwhelming I thought it was gonna be really overwhelming but no, it's it's looking really great. But we're going to show you, and we got some stuff from her, so she wants to sit here, and she is just, just happy. She's always happy. Look at that big smile. She's just always happy. Let's take that nook out so they can see that beautiful smile. Can you wave? Yeah, say wave at everybody. Say hi, everyone. Say we're enjoying this toddler so much. Love her. Got her off of AliExpress, if you didn't see that video. Uh, she's the copy of the Mila Sculpt by Ping Lao. And uh, the only difference is that she has a full cloth body instead of that upper torso. Other than that, she's identical. And we just love her. Yeah. Let me give you a kiss. Because that big smile just makes me so happy when I see that big, big smile. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. And then we got that uh, other video that went up of your crying brother, right? You just get a headache when he's here. Because that's all he does is cry. That's all chaos does, right? Um, but anyways, yeah, let's go over this haul. So, um, you know that I needed, well, we'll just, as I go along, I'll just show you stuff. Um, let's just go ahead and, um, just, I guess just start anywhere. Okay. So I'm going to show you, uh, I'll just go over it quickly because as I do the videos, I explain more about the, uh, clothing. So we'll just do that quick, but we got some stuff from Mariska. Mariska's got a pretty decent amount of clothing, not a huge amount, but she's got a pretty decent amount. I just added a few more things for her, but, um, uh, Gunner needed a wardrobe because I showed you guys when I did his uh, blanket reveal. He just had a few things I had gotten for him. So I found stuff at a grad sale for a quarter and 50 cents for him. Outfits, it's just unbelievable. So, all right, so we'll show you first hers. This was at, um, this was a Goodwill purchase. But look at this, you guys. Look at this dress. Look at Mariska. You're going to be so pretty in this. So we're just going to go over it quickly. But we got our beautiful dress here, black and white with the red bow. And this I just love. This also was from a Goodwill. Look at this, you guys. Isn't that adorable? This is done with that Tula. And it's the beautiful skirt and everything with that jean top with the, uh, is that Mickey? Yeah, it's Mickey on there. Look at that. Yeah, she loves her new stuff. She can't wait. She loves to be pretty. And then I got her this one at a Goodwill. Isn't that adorable? It kind of reminds me of the Mickey theme too. But uh, Mickey or Minnie, just adorable. Adorable, adorable, adorable. I love, always wanted a girly girl. So, yes. All right, and then we'll go over and show you, let's see what's in here. I never know if I've got any more for her. If I do, I'll just show you. But another um, thing that I got for her for the nursery and for her to enjoy is um, we got her a little uh, car seat at a grad sale. For, I paid a dollar for this, you guys. So she's got a car seat, and I got that baby from my friend Michelle from Blessing Reborn Dolls. I'll stick it up on the screen. Definitely check her channel out. Um, I got this in one of the box openings as one of the lovies for um, Constance, when I got Constance, my real born, uh, the uh, Eversculpt. I got that from her. Um, so now she's got this little baby. This will be her little baby to play with along with this one. Uh, but she's got that in a little car seat for us. So I thought that was fun. And then we got her, and I'm just going to lift it up and then I'll put it back down. We got this at, that was at a grad sale. This was at a Goodwill. Look at her rocking chair. Yeah, she's got a chair that she sits in. And it sits in the nursery, really cute. My nursery is right off my living room, you guys. If you haven't seen it yet, um, definitely check out that. I'll link it down. Um, I'll put it in the comment section if you want to see that. That way, when I do the new tour, you'll get to see the difference. All right. And then um, I got her, uh, let's see. Oh, let me grab that. It's over here. I just kind of want to show you the stuff that I got for her. And there's a few other things, but got her a high chair. And it's not for her to sit in, but I believe she could fit in it. Definitely one of the babies could fit in it, but this is more of a, a baby doll one. So I got that for her to play with, with her dollies to put her dollies in it. And it opens up just so cute. I literally paid $2 for this, you guys, two bucks. I couldn't believe it. It was just unbelievable. So she's got a height chair for her babies. And I believe, like I said, she could actually sit in that. It is plenty of room for her to sit in it. With her being a toddler, it'd be cute to sit her in it to eat as well. So it could be used for both, but it'll be sitting in the nursery. 
All right, and then we got her another baby. I saw this one. Um, I, I don't know why I'm not thinking of the name. It's Elsa, but this is the sister, and I can't remember the sister's name. Just, it's slipped my mind, but this is for her. Yeah, look, you got another baby. Another baby, yeah. That's for you, so you have dollies to play with because she's very girly girl. She likes her dollies, and I, I just can't believe I don't remember the name of this one because I love Frozen, and it's just, my mind's drawing a blank right now. So that is um, for her to play with. Then I found this little outfit at a Goodwill for her. Look at how cute this is, you guys. Isn't that adorable? And it's got a dove on it. And dove represents God. So I thought that would be so cute on her with like a little red top under it or pink. Well, it's got the red on it. So I'd probably act, you know, accent with red and maybe little red shoes. I got her some, which I will be showing you. I think it's in this bag. I really hope that all of it's here. Um, I believe it is. I hope so. Uh, okay, so that's that. And then, I don't know if there's any pieces in there for her. Um, let me see what this is here. Where did I put that? I hope that that is here. Um, I got some shoes for her too, but I'm not sure if that ended up in the bag here. It had to have been in one of the bags. If not, I will find it and share it with you guys. But yeah, I feel like I'm missing something, but maybe I threw it all in here. We'll have to just look once we get uh, done. But okay, so now I'm going to show you what I got for Gunner. We're just going to go really quick because he needed a wardrobe, and boy, I got him a wardrobe. So we got him this, Old Navy. And again, like I said, as I put the outfits on him, I will uh, share it with you. So somewhere from Once Upon a Child, somewhere from the Goodwill. I got him this. And this goes with that chair. It's just a wrap that goes with that chair. I noticed it was in that day. I got him this jumper. Got him, and then, now mind you guys, a quarter to 50 cents is what I paid uh, for most of this. Some of it was from, like I said, Goodwill and Once Upon a Child, but 99% uh, of it was from a garage sale. Just do it in a pair of sweatpants with the fall coming. He's gonna need some you know, outfits like that. Um, got him this romper, just a black romper, like the shorts one. We got him a all-star in training romper. We got him another romper, this one here with the crocodile on it. Got him these little shorts, and I think there was a top I grabbed with it, or a onesie, I can't remember. When I get to that, we'll, we'll hold this out. When I get to that, I'll show you. Got him, let's see, this uh, onesie. This, my husband was in the Navy, so I thought saw this onesie and thought, oh, he's got to have this, special, especially to show his muscles. And then I got him this little pair of shorts. It's root, it's got like root, uh, it says 36 on it and different things on it. It's really cute. Again, I'll just explain all that when I get to that point. I got him this cute outfit. It's the pants, like a pair of sweatpants, and this shirt with the ghost on it. Be perfect for Halloween time. And let's see here. And these bib overall shorts that we'll put uh, something cute with that. Um, pair of gray sweatpants. Again, I think I'm matching it up with something in here. I don't know what though. Let's see. Was that everything in there? Oh, no. Okay. Then I got him this. Look at this. I love that. It's a, a, you know, snaps in the crotch, one piece outfit like that, like a jumper or a romper type thing, but it's like a, a onesie. Love that, that's adorable. And let's see, so his stuff. Maybe the shorts I was gonna do with one of those, um, with one of those onesies. So the black shorts go with one of those onesies. And I got him this, it's got a hood on it. Look at how cute that is, you guys. It's got a hood on it, isn't that adorable? Boy, he's got a nice wardrobe now. And I think, is that everything for the clothing for him? I think that is it. I got a few things for myself. Um, I want to get it off these hangers. I hate it being on these hangers. I got myself this. It's a sweater dress. It'd be more for the fall, but a sweater dress. Thought that was really cute from a grad sale. Got this from a grad sale. 
I want to just take it off the hangers because I hate the hangers. I hate that part when you're trying to show something. I hate hangers. I got this cute dress. It's strapless. This really pretty flowy dress. I got to wash everything up. Uh, but it was in really good condition. I got this dress. I love dresses in the summer. So I got that dress, that spaghetti strap. It's really long. I love the longer dresses. That's really cute. I was going to have one on today, but I want to get this stuff washed first, of course. I got this blouse. Like that. And then I got this dress. I thought that was pretty. It's really long, too. I like the longer dresses. Along with the shorter ones, too, but I like the longer ones. And then I get this off the hanger. I got this. This is a romper. Pair of shorts. Isn't that pretty? Really pretty for the summer. Okay. And then I got myself this sweatshirt here. This is uh, Diva Pink. So the Victoria's Secrets. Just as, you know, sweatshirt you zip up. And it says it on the back there. Um, can't, you know, have a haul without getting a few things for yourself. Uh, but this was mostly a nursery haul. Look at this picture, you guys, by Ann. What is it? Ann uh, Geeds is how you say it, or Geds? I'm not sure how you say that. But I just loved it. It was 50 cents. Look, I had to have it for the nursery. Look, it's like she's looking down. It reminded me of myself. Looking down since having this his hysterectomy. Looking down and going, what is this? It's like I could just hear the expression on her face like, what is this? What happened? <laughs> Isn't that adorable? So cute. So that will be hanging in the nursery. And then this will go up uh, with my uh, nursery stuff up on the shelving. Got another, um, <laughs> my God, why can't I think of his name? Star Wars and it's Yoda. Yeah, Yoda, duh. Yoda, another Yoda with the cute little outfit on. The other one I have, I think is a baby version of Yoda. The one I had gotten and, and showed you guys last time. I think it's a baby version. Can you see where it is? up there somewhere. I'm going to put that up there. And I don't know what year is even on this one. I don't even know if it's even uh, dated old or anything, but got that. We got a Yoda for in the room along with the other Yoda. Got some uh, little um, stuffies. I always like to get extra stuffies either to put up or to give to the um, babies as I get them. Got some palm puppies. I thought that was cool because that's older, you know, the palm puppies, which of course they came back with them. So these probably are not even old, but where I got this from the Gratzel, uh, this Yep, these say 1985. So these are uh, re uh, retro, or um, uh, well, we're just going to say retro right now, but I'll put it on the screen what I was trying to say. And then we got a Pluto and a Mickey and Minnie. Again, they can go up on my shelf with my stuffed animals, or they can be for lovies for the, the babies. All right, I got a little toy for her. I'm trying to find, like I said, little toys for her. Look at it. Got you a little piano toy. Got her a toy. And for the, you know, uh, for Gunner, he'll like to hold on to that. And then I found this for my prayer wall. I couldn't pass it up for my prayer wall. Beautiful cross. I thought that was gorgeous with the Lord on it. We're going to put that and done in that gold. I'm going to put that on my prayer wall. If you guys don't know that, I have a wall that I call my prayer wall. And then I got some patent leather shoes at Once Upon a Child for her, the black, because she has white. So now she has black because she needed a few pairs of shoes. And then she's got the red. That's what I was talking about, the little red. These are brand new. I got from Once Upon a Child, brand new um, Cat and Jack. And I paid $3.50 for these. So she's got a little pair. I have to because I'm a Wizard of Oz fan. And it made me think of the Wizard of Oz. And it'll go with that one dress. So And other outfits, like even that white outfit with the red shirt under it and these shoes would be super cute. And then I got these little tennis shoes. They're going to be for Gunner. But they also can be for her too because they're kind of uh, neutral, you know, neutral gen gender. So I got these two so that both can wear, but they're, they're for him because Gunnar got a few um, pairs of shoes. And I think I forgot to show you his shoes when I showed his stuff. Um, I forgot to show his shoes. I don't know why I didn't show the shoes. Um, so when I do a video on him, if I put the shoes on, I'll show those to you. All right. And then I was just shocked when I got this, you guys, just shocked. Um, this lady had these porcelain dolls. And so this is the first one I want to share with you guys. Now, it definitely needs to be cleaned up. They're pretty dirty, these babies. This has got actual hair on it. And it is a um, a sugar britches. And it's from 19, uh, let's see here, 1986. And I did look it up. And um, she just needs to be cleaned up. And the lady just said, I don't know. They, they you know, need to be cleaned and stuff. Some tender loving care with them. I'll need to clean the clothes and stuff. I think it's the original outfit that came on her with the bonnet. I love that. Uh, but she said five bucks. So I got this for five bucks. It's a porcelain. I'll put it up with my, um, you know, my stuff that is the retro, um, you know, stuff. I keep saying the name wrong, but, 
And then I got this, and it even came with the uh, the pillow. I got myself a, um, what do they call it? A Flirty Eye Gerber Baby in the original christening outfit and the pillow that she lays on. Look at that, you guys. And it's Flirty Eyes, see? Isn't that cute? And this is 1981. And as you just kind of move her around, she... You know, the eyes are flirty like they move around. I couldn't believe that I found a Gerber baby for $5 at a garage sale. It is the Gerber baby 1981 flirty eyes. Yes, and with the original, I couldn't believe it came with the original outfit. This has the original outfit. Of course, I'll have to clean it up and clean her up a little bit, but she's in great condition. Let me show you. I didn't even really look at her legs or anything, but look at those chunky little legs. Isn't that sweet? And then she actually had the pillow she laid on. And I couldn't believe she just told me five bucks a piece. I couldn't believe she was, look, it even comes with a pillow and stuff. She goes, but I know they need to be cleaned up a little bit and stuff. So just, I don't know. She goes, what do you think? Five bucks? And I'm like, sold. <laughs> so yeah, I just, you know, excited to add some of the um, uh, stuff, you know, from back in time. Anything over 20 years is retro. Is um, I keep forgetting the word. Honey, what's that word? Vintage. 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 I wish I could remember that. I always say retro. Vintage. Anything over 20 years is vintage. So I got some great vintage stuff. And I love that I have a Gerber baby. And she's in really good shape. She's even cleaner, better, and, you know, nicer than the other one. But still, you know, just happy about that. All right. And then I'm going to show you quick the um, other two pieces. I got, I had to have a uh, bouncy for Gunner. And it's a bigger one for him because he's a big baby. So I got this bouncer. It's got the vibrator on it. You know, the vibrating chair. Uh, bouncy like that. So we got him that so that he can sit in that. Love that. And, and I have a photograph of him in it. And then I got this because I've got all the clothes in the back hung. But now that I got new babies and they've got, you know, their new clothes now, I thought this would work perfect. Now, I know this is like a shoe rack or a rack you can hang wet clothes on, different things. You can use this thing for anything. I'm going to use both sides to hang Gunner's clothes and Mariska's clothes. And then how perfect just to sit in a room. It doesn't take up much space at all. But then I'll have, you know a chair to, I mean, a shelf there to put up all the clothes because I'm losing all the room on the ceiling. Now I have a pole going across on the ceiling. My dad helped me put it up for me coming down from the ceiling in the bedroom where I keep all the baby clothes in there because it would look terrible out here like that. But I just have it in there. That's where all the clothes are. But that would be perfect because I'm like, I don't have any room left on that rack. And I, now that I have these babies, see the other ones are all newborn, you know, preemie to newborn size uh, or the three month. And so I had enough clothes for those babies to share. Well, these two couldn't share. She's a girl, he's a boy. And you know, she wears a smaller size than him. So yeah, it's just like, it's just, I, I had to have a rack for it. And then I did get, let me grab one more thing to show you. If I can quick here, give me one second. My mom was over today and uh, she got an outfit for Mariska. So I wanted to show you that. It's just, darling, brand new, you guys, at a grad sale, I think she said, or a Goodwill. Look at this, you guys. Look at It's big roses done in a cream color. It's a brand new outfit, but she found it at a uh, Goodwill and it's got the little bloomers with it, the silky little bloomers, and it is like a cream color. But oh my gosh, is that going to look so pretty on her? So my mom had grabbed that for her because my mom loves these babies too, really loves them. But yeah, she grabbed that and I wanted to share that in there. And then my mom uh, got me just a fun, I don't know, if, uh, she said it's not a costume, it's an actual dress, but could be used for a costume, but it's a little bit big, so I'm going to have to take it in for myself. But she just found this too, just a fringe dress like that, which fringe is really big and in right now, but it'd be cute for a costume too, you know, for the roaring 20s. I did a video like that, but um, just fun, you know, maybe for Halloween or actually wear it. I don't know. I don't know if I would actually wear that. So she got that for me too. But yeah, like I said, there are a few pairs of shoes that I have for Gunner and I may have showed them. I don't know if I showed them in his haul. I don't know if I did, but when I go to change them and stuff, I'll show you because I it would take me a minute to get to them right now. But because um, I got everything back there that I got to start putting away now, putting on the racks and putting away as I'm sharing each baby because I get a little bit of a haul for each baby. So, but now we're set for Gunner for a while and set for her. Can you still see her? God, she got hid back there. Yeah. Yeah, you got hit back there. She's so happy with all this stuff she got. Yeah, she's so happy. Yeah, she's happy.
Look up at everybody. Yeah, say hi. Say, I'm one lucky girl. Yeah, say, I like my new home. I love that my mommy and daddy adopted me, and we're just fitting right in. Love you, sweet girl. And um, I'm not sure how you'll get this video because I'm going to be doing a video on her. So I'm not sure how you'll get this or unless you'll get like three videos in one day if I do the haul. Because, of course, um, with this stuff, I wanted to, uh, yeah, I wanted to do the haul first. That's right. And then do a video on her because, of course, I would love to take some photographs with her with her new toys and stuff like that. Because I like to photograph a, you know, especially her being a toddler. I like to set her up and have fun with her. So I wanted to get the haul up first. So you're going to get three videos today. Hope that didn't overwhelm you guys, but I hope you enjoy watching. Of course, you don't have to watch them all in one day, but I hope you guys enjoyed that haul. Yeah, a lot of nice stuff and just literally so cheap for everything. It was just so cheap. So I'm really glad. That's why I like to thrift shop. Do you guys like to thrift shop? Just let me know down below. I love thrift, sh you know, thrift shopping. Shopping. I don't have to have all new, but of course with each baby, I do like to have a couple new pieces. I do. I really do like to have a couple new pieces for each one as if you were to get a new baby. If you had a new baby, you don't get a new baby. I mean, have a new baby. Of course, you'd have a baby shower. You'd get new clothes for each child you have. So I like to have a little bit of, you know, a few pieces new. And then of course, um, some old pieces and, um, but I love thr uh, thrift shopping. And I love the uh, vintage stuff I got that I'm going to be putting up. Like I said, once I get it all set up and everything's done and fixed and stuff like that, then I will give you another tour. But I'm going to list down below the first tour of it before I got, you know, the babies I got now and, um, you know, what it looked like before and then after. So you guys can kind of see how I, I did the setup. But anyways, we get, we love you. And Marissa's going to throw you guys a kiss. Go. Mm -hmm. She loves all you guys out there. She loves God and mommy and daddy, all her brothers and sisters and the auntie and uncles out there and grandma and grandpas. And of course, all of her uh, twinsies, all of her twin cousins out there and all the cousins, but she loves all her little twins too. All right, you guys, well, everybody take care and I love you too. And everybody take care, but remember God loves you more, right? God loves you the most. Remember that. And of course, I already did a reading for today, so I didn't have to do this, but Everybody take care. God bless. And I will see each and every one of you in my very next upload.